everybody, welcome back to my channel. Here is my cosmetology kit. I don't know if you can tell, but it's huge. It's as tall as my hip. Wow, that's pretty big. Not much is in these little holder things. There's like hair lotion in this. Also on the outside is this squirty bottle and it has mannequin shampoo. Mannequin shampoo is just low quality shampoo that we wouldn't use on a client. The reason I have this is for finger waving. There are some things that I have that are considered to be my kit that I can't fit in here, being six mannequin heads, a mannequin head stand. This is all stuff I keep at school, by the way. My barbering kit, like my, you know. So if you ever steal my keys, this is the one to unlock my kit. Okie dokie. It's hard to organize this thing, I, I have to be honest. Also, this was really expensive. I count my lucky stars each and every day for financial aid. To everyone who doesn't get financial aid for this kit, wow, that sucks. First thing I pick up, a paddle brush. <laughs> this is a Denman Pro paddle brush. There are a thousand brushes, so don't get bored. Here I keep a ton of brushes and clips. This is called a vent brush. In here I have a ton of combs. Mm. You wouldn't even think that we use all these combs, but we do use all these combs. Uh, whoa, hi. This is just an all-purpose comb. You've probably seen this one before. This is a gray Rat tail, rat tail, all purpose. <laughs> wow, this is really exciting. Uh, we haven't used this one. I don't actually know the name of it. You wouldn't even think that we use all these combs, but we do use all these combs. The lighting is the worst, so I apologize for that. Pintail, wide tooth, your grandma probably has one of these, and if your mom is a grandma, like mine, your mom might have one of them. Pintail, ugh, there's so many, there's like, uh, like what even this is so weird. What is that? I don't know I just keep them in this little plastic thing it came with just to keep them contained pretty much, you know Oh, except apparently it's broken on the other side cool. I have a teasing comb used this one a lot this week We have a thousand different round brush sizes just kidding only like four here's two of them My favorite clips are gator clips and I already lost one I feel like that's weird to lose one that fast, but it's okay. I really like them I'll probably buy some more because they're not very expensive. They're called gator clips because doink Ooh. These are also called jaw clips. I call them gator clips because I'm scared of alligators and it makes me feel a little less scared of them because I love these clips. I have some double prong clips and single prong clips. These are in a contaminated bag because they're contaminated. I have a apron, kind of cute apron actually I gotta say. It's very wrinkly because I don't take care of things very well and it smells like school to me. Or we can wear this burgundy smock, which I also left at school. Um, but most of the time I wear this because it's cuter. If you didn't know already, you need to wear all black at school, so hence it being black. I don't know why the burgundy smock is burgundy though. Wow, I'm gonna regurgitate. We have this <laughs> janky thing. This is a, guess what? hair dryer. Uh, this thing kept falling off, so I taped it. You gotta do what you gotta do. I'm forgetting what this is called. I learned recently, like probably yesterday, and I forgot. Another Denman brush. This little brush here is for hair color, and that's an all-purpose comb, and that's one of my bowls. We haven't used this yet. It's for, uh, you know, nails, painting nails. What's it called? Nail polish? Manicures, there it is. We're not gonna use this for a while. It's an interesting texture. Hey, you stop being a bully. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. <laughs> hey everyone, hope everybody's doing well. Most of this is nail stuff. Nail stuff! Tweezers, little things to cut, little things to push the cuticle down. Ooh. These are for um, cleaning, you know, by going shh. These little brushes, a couple little fingies, and a little fingy stand put it on top coat base coat and nail polish and more nail clippers we have another little nail cleaning brush I believe this is uh, you know one of those little cups to put your hand on 
in when you're getting manicured. Again, since we haven't done manicures yet, I'm not sure the proper terminology, but this is one of those bowls that you like have your hands soaking in while the other one's being painted, you know what I mean? We have tons of nail files because once one is used, you have to throw it away. Kind of devastating. This is a tiny mini whisk. Reminds me of the days of yore when Emma Chamberlain talked about mini whisks all the time and like whisks. What was that? Like, I don't remember. This is for mixing hair color together with the developer, I guess, but nobody ever uses this. We just use the hair color brush. This is, I think, for acrylics or something. Another nail thing, I'm pretty sure. This is so funny. I feel like I should be doing this senior year, not week five of freshman year. This is an eyebrow kit, so we're gonna learn how to like wax eyebrows or something, like do eyebrows. This thing, whoa, I thought that was gonna be smoother, it was not. Okay, we have multiple little hair color brushes. I feel like these have a different name than what I keep calling them, whatever. And then a couple more bowls. My favorite's the black one. I hate these clips. They are so not helpful, but we have five of them. Oh, apparently we have six of them. I faked ya. This is some stand. Don't know, <laughs> I gotta say. Uh, this I'm so excited for. This is a Styling razor made in Japan. I'm just really excited about this. I think it's gonna be dope. These are a whole box of duckbill clips. This is a timer for like when you're doing hair color or need to wait for anything like a perm or something like that. But most of the time we just use our phones. More duckbill clips. Wow, we just have a lot of clips. I just kind of forgot. These is not what I thought they were. <laughs> this is uh, hair cutting scissors. There's different types of hair cutting scissors. These are their like thinning shears kind of, and that's just like straight, sharp scissors. We got a hair curler. This thing is so loose. I'm like, what the heck? And then a uh, flat iron. This is a hair cutting drape. A ton of different little bottles that have different names on them. We have a mirror. <laughs> uh, we were told what this is for and don't remember. I definitely know what this is for. I forget the name of it. It's for like hair color. Ooh, this is good. We were just learning about this actually. Hydrogen. No, that's not that word says. Doesn't that look like it says hydrogen though? That looks like it says hydrogen, but it's hydro. Sorry, I can't read backwards. Hydrian, 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 probably. So these are little strips that test your pH. When you're coloring a client's hair, uh, you should check their pH to make sure it won't fall out, basically. Yeah, the end. <laughs> That's everything in my kit. Isn't that kind of exciting? From what I've had the privilege of using so far, it's been pretty high quality stuff, actually. Like, it's middle of the line. It's not low quality. It's not the best of the best, but it's pretty good. I always liked watching these so i hope you liked it subscribe for more of me and i'll see you all very soon goodbye